Welcome to the Farmer's Voice. This week we're at the South Island Agricultural Field Days and we're going to have a look at the backstory behind the volunteers that run these field days and make them the success that they are. Thanks for being part of the Farmer's Voice. Uh, the South Island Agricultural Field Days, one of the biggest events in Canterbury by far. It doesn't just happen by itself, a lot of volunteers. Yeah, no, there's 24 volunteers on the committee and they put in a lot of hours. So we've got dairy farmers, we've got cropping farmers, sheep and beef farmers, and we've got contractors and um, consultants. Very passionate group? Yes, they all get along good and get the work done. the moving forward after the field days because it's only every two years what happens in the planning stages from this field days to the next so luckily enough um, once the field days is finished we've got a good working relationship with our neighbor Tony Redman and he leases the farm in the, uh, when the field days aren't on and you know straight after the field days finishes we'll have a debrief and and there'll be some uh, ideas that we want to uh, improve on and things that will alter to make the next event run more smoothly and we'll also be looking at uh, maybe prioritising with um, the infrastructure and that sort of thing. Alistair, the South Island Agricultural Field Days is an incorporated society. What does that actually mean? Uh, yes it is. So we're a non-profit organisation and we're also a charity. So. Uh, any profits we make, we um, do try and put some of them back into improving the uh, overall facility here. However, we also try to um, donate quite a bit of money to um, various other community organisations like uh, some of the local Lions and we've donated money to the Westpac Trust Helicopter and uh, St John's Fire Brigade and we also give out um, up to two uh, scholarship to Lincoln students for two and a half thousand dollars a year. If you were a young person on farm or even off farm, is it a good thing to be involved in something like this for your own development? Yes it is. Yes. And you'd recommend it? Oh for sure, like, you know, we're, we're all like-minded people and uh, everybody gets on well and we've all got a common uh, goal of, uh, you know, um, achieving a successful field days and uh, everybody just gets stuck in and works really well together. A good team of volunteers put together a great event here at the South Island Agricultural Field Days. Any money left over, they spend wisely throughout the community and some scholarships to Lincoln University. Thanks for watching the Farmer's Voice. Farmer's Voice, brought to you by PGG Rights and Livestock.